Hi everyone! Welcome back Roso Online! 5 Best Android Emulators for PC and Mac of 2022 We talk a lot about emulating computer experiences on our phones. Let's look at the best Android emulators. There are a lot of valid reasons why someone would want to run Android emulators on their PC. App developers may be trying to test their application before shipping it out. Gamers may want to use a mouse and keyboard on their games. Maybe you just want it there to have it. In any case, Android emulation on PC is possible and it's a lot easier than it used to be. Some old favorites either left the space or became unusable at some point, Handy, Amido OS, and LeapDroid, but everything else here should work okay for most people. Here are the best Android emulators for PC and Mac. It's also worth noting that Windows 11 has native Android app support. You can read a tutorial on how that works here and you can even use the Play Store if you want to go through the effort. Google also launched Google Play Games on Windows 11 in beta. The native support will be a great option for gamers when it's fully launched. It should replace a lot of emulator use cases, making this list obsolete. The last thing we'll say is that if you go with the native Windows 11 route, please make sure to be careful. Some tools, like this one, seem to be installing malware on people's PCs. The best Android emulators for PC and Mac. Number 1 Bluestacks Bluestacks is known by many users to be the most comprehensive Android app player in the market and with good reason. Aside from running on both Windows and Mac, this emulator comes jam-packed with a ton of features to improve the gamer's experience. Its most popular features include the key mapping tool to create customized control schemes, the instance manager through which you can create multiple instances of the emulator and run several games simultaneously, and quality of life features like eco mode, which help to reduce resource consumption while running the most demanding games. It's also the safest emulator out there, with certified GDPR compliance, your data is always safe with them. The most recent version, Bluestacks 5, is the lightest and fastest the emulator has ever been, delivering high-performance gaming even on low-end devices. The latest version addresses some of the most common complaints of the previous version, namely, the fact that it can feel bloated, especially when running on inferior hardware. Try it right now for yourself and discover why Bluestacks has a community of over 500 million gamers around the world. Number 2 LD Player LD Player is a lightweight Android emulator focusing on gaming performance. Running Android Nougat 7.1, it features the usual array of gamer-oriented features, including good keyboard mapping controls, multi-instance, macros, high FPS, and graphical support. It supports many games, including Epic 7, Clash of Clans, Arknights, and many others. This is one of the few emulators on the list that gets active updates to improve compatibility. In the latest versions, LD Player has optimized the smoothness of Free Fire and Mobile Legends and fixed the device restriction on Moonlight Sculptor. Besides that, LD Player is also a well-rounded emulator for using TikTok, Instagram, and other popular apps. It borrows a bit of design from Bluestacks, but that's not really a bad thing. It's a good all-rounder and should fit most needs. Number 3 Android Studio Emulator Android Studio is the default development console, integrated development environment, or IDE, for Android. It comes with a bunch of tools to help developers make apps and games specifically for Android. As it turns out, there is also a built-in emulator that you can use to test out your app or game. We use the emulator to test out new versions of Android from time to time. 
The setup is rather complicated so it won't appeal to everyone but it is by far the fastest and most feature-rich option on this list. You can run vanilla Android, download apps from the Google Play Store as you normally would, add custom launchers and keyboards, and emulate any size or form factor device. You can even try out foldable devices. Number 4 MEMU Emulator MEMU is another excellent Android emulator that seems to do quite well with gamers. One of its biggest features is support for both AMD and Intel chipsets. Most work on AMD processors, but it's nice to see developers specifically pay attention to AMD's platform. The latest MEMU runs Android 7.1, a big jump from its early days when it ran 4.3 Jelly Bean. You can even run multiple instances at once for multiple games or testing features. It aims itself at gamers much like Bluestacks and similar emulators, but it's usable as a productivity tool too. The premium version runs for $2.99 per month and it disables ads, adds more customization options, and enables premium support options. The emulator gets updates on a fairly frequent basis. You can check out the running change log here. Number 5 Remix OS Player Remix OS Player by G-Day is an older Android emulator for PC. It runs Android Marshmallow and that's not the newest you can find these days. The installation process is pretty simple and using it is also fairly easy. It caters mostly to gamers. There are a few gamer-specific features along with a customizable toolbar. It boasts features like running multiple games at once. That said, it's a fairly clean emulator so it's still perfectly usable as a productivity tool. The official site seems to be down and we're relatively certain Remix OS Player isn't in active development anymore. You can still download the builds from SourceForge in case you want something older, but still reasonably stable. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe now my channel.